in a tie all time with Carlos Lee for all time home runs. This ball's hit deep to left field, and he's just done it. 28th career leadoff home run. 133rd home run of his career. Welcome to the top 10, George Springer. Springer Dinger to get things going. Such a weapon at the top of this lineup for A.J. Hinch, turning around 96 miles an hour. He moves into 10th all-time by himself in leadoff home runs. And he ties Carlos Lee for the Astros all-time list with 133. Got a ways to go for Biggio. He's got 53 of them in his career, but George keeps hitting them at this rate. We'll start to. Bregman in the center field. Hamilton is there. Springer will tag. The throw will go to second. Sacrifice fly for Alex Bregman. Astros lead two to nothing. Good job by Alex. That one plenty deep enough. Really didn't look like Billy Hamilton had a chance to get behind that fly ball to try and make an attempt. But he also didn't want to lose Altuve and have him move into second base. For Bradley. Ball hit high, deep right field. Owings back, looking up. Good home run! Michael Brantley, his eighth home run of the year. Astros in front, four to nothing. The Brantley man can. A lot of fun to watch hit. <laughs> George and Uncle Mike. That's the extent of the Brantley shenanigans in the Astros dugout. Yeah, he lost it right there, didn't he? <laughs> Gosh, keep it contain yourself. How about this? That's his 20th straight plate appearance where he's not had a swing or a miss. Are you kidding me? He's got the longest active streak. This guy's unbelievable. But that is a changeup that got yanked down and in. There you go. That's that uh, circle change. You can see it. Great look on the super mode, but he pulls it across the plate, and that is right into the happy zone. How about that? Looks like he got it a little bit off the end of the bat. But still got a pretty good distance out there in right field next to the bullpen. 387 feet. There's a smile. <laughs> so the last six games, he has eight runs batted in. Correa to center field, sending Hamilton back, still back at the wall. This one's gone. Carlos Correa. He gets his ninth home run. Back to back, Jacks, Brantley, and Correa. Good to see him back smiling again this year. Happy, healthy, a lot of plate coverage. Talked about the adjustments in the swing yesterday. And then he unleashed to center field here at Minute Maid Park. What a bad one two punch. Whew. Third time this year, the Astros have gone back to back. Ball in the center field. Hamilton will drift in a little bit. Reddick's going to tag up. Reddick's going to come home. Here comes the throw by Hamilton. It is not in time. Sack fly and let miss Diaz. Astros now lead six to nothing as Reddick scores. I like it. Josh forcing the issue. Like you said, this time Billy Hamilton had a chance to get behind that throw. This would be a great view of that throw coming home. Just took Maldonado far enough away from the plate to where he can vacate and allow a sliding lane for Josh Reddick to 
get in easily. Maldonado runs to the Astros dugout. He reaches over the railing and almost ran into a camera and makes the play to end the bottom of the fourth. The Astros get another run. They lead 7-0. This ball's hit pretty well to right field. Michael Brantley, two home runs tonight. Seven up the Astros. Brantley a multi home run game. There goes that Brantley guy again. Wow. How happy is George going to be? This is going to be unbelievable. <laughs> Three in home runs. And he hits a high fly ball to center field, still deep enough to score a run. Tagging is Yuli. Hamilton won't even make a play. Sacrifice fly for Springer. It's 9 0. George is driven in the second run of the night. You're going to do a lot of coloring tonight, Blummer.